Okay, so we're done with my face. Now let's move on with the eyes naman. For my uh for the eyelids, for the eyeshadow, I keep using only three shades, which is this lighter one and then this one and the other one which is the darker one. So let's move on with the eyes. guys welcome again to my youtube channel if ever you are new here my name is glad and i'm so glad to meet all of you for today's video i will be sharing with you my simple everyday makeup look so with no further ado let's begin so bago tayo maglagay ng makeup sa face natin we need to prep up our face first after kong maligo naglalagay ako ng toner sa mukha ko and after that, rejuvenating cream and then the sunblock. Kahit hindi ako lalabas ng bahay, I always make sure that I always put sunblock on my face. I watch a lot of videos from Solens. Natutunan ko sa kanya yung pag apply ng cream sa mukha should be from down going up para hindi maglog yung face natin. So, it's like this. Ganyan. And then, from the eyes. And I also do like this. And one thing na natutunan ko din kay Solen is the pinching of her eyebrows. And totoo nga na, nakaka-relax. We will use this BYS Face Primer Upward Direction. Like that. And so, hindi naman ako talaga magaling maglagay ng makeup. I do it my way. So, kung may mali man kayong makikita sa akin, don't practice it. Just wanna share with you my simple everyday makeup look. For my makeup, I always wanted to make my face look natural kahit meron akong makeup na nilalagay. So, sa leeg, natutunan ko din, it should be upward direction when you put anything on your neck. Medyo itatry lang natin yung face primer. The foundation. By the way, this foundation is the Maybelline Fit Me in the shade of 220 or 220. I use my hands or rather my fingers when putting foundation kasi mas nabe-blend ko siya ng maayos. So, I put here and on top of my nose. I do like this. Uh-huh. Medyo makapal siyang tignan sa camera, pero later on, pagka na-absorb na ng skin yung foundation, hindi na siya ganun ka, ano, kapute. Hindi ako gamagamit ng sponge kasi hindi ko siya nabiblend ng maayos. Tapos yung natitira nilalagay ko sa neck. Okay. I hope I'm doing it right. So, yan. And the nose. Okay. If you're someone whom I work with, You'll know that hindi talaga ako naglalagay ng makeup every day. It's very seasonal and it's very occasional. Very rare. 
Kasi tamad nga ako. Gusto ko pagising ko nung umaga. Maliligo lang ako and then that's it. Go go to work na agad. After putting foundation, I will be putting the concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 20 Sand. <clears throat> Sobrang konti lang nang nilalagay ko. Kung ano lang yung makuha ko, yun na siya. So, like this. dito sa forehead kaya naglalagay din ako dito I'm gonna blend it using my finger as well perfectly on my skin and I'll be putting also in this part of the ano kasi dito yung sumpa <laughs> my pimples so I'm gonna blend it also with my finger so after concealing my face I will be doing my eyebrows for my eyebrows I'm using this Everbelena Advanced Silky Brow Liner and also this Nichido um, Nichido Eyebrow Gel. I brush my brows first like this. I'm not an expert doing the eyebrows. I'm not expert doing makeup thing. Kung ano lang yung feeling ko na maganda ang ayos sa akin or I feel confident about it. That's it. And the other side. Then I apply the eyeline, the, the brow liner. Not too much kasi makapal na yung ano ko, uh, brow. So like this lang, and then ito medyo sa taas. Mas tina darker ko yung dito sa end sa side ng end. So ganyan lang. Then I will just brush it on the upward direction and towards the end of the eyebrows. With the eyebrows, I like the ombre look, like, dito lighter, and then dun sa end, I dark, um, sorry, dark, darker. Nata na naman yung problema ko sa letter R. I don't want to apply too much, kasi feeling ko hindi bagay sa mukha ko yung sobrang kapal ng kilay. When I was younger, Pina, ano ko, pinaahit ko yung kilay ko ng sobrang nipis as in one liner and nagalit yung lola ko sabi niya gusto mo ba na pagtanda mo wala ka ng kilay at maglalagay ka na lang ng tattoo and I see a lot of you know sorry yung mga matatanda na nagkikilay using tattoo and sabi ko ayoko ng ganon so from then on onwards hindi ko na talaga pinaahit yung kilay ko I do threading dito sa kilay ko. But of course, I let someone do it kasi hindi, hindi ko siya kaya. Then after applying the, um, the the brow liner, naglalagay ako ng gel. Pero minimal lang. And hindi ko masyadong dinidiinan kasi minsan pagka sumobra yung gel, parang na-stuck na lang yung yung product sa isang side. So, ang pangit niya tignan. I want the eyebrows to look very natural. I'll be doing naman the contouring. For the contouring, I'm using this um, BTLA Sculpt Trio. I use this ano, shade contour. 
sobrang taba ng face ko ngayon. Kaya, dinadaihan ko talaga. Forehead, dito sa my hairline. Just going to blend it in the circular, circular motion. And lifting it on the upper part of my face. When you have braces, you will understand na merong ano, problema sa R. So I do it like this. And this like this. So blending is always the key. Forehead, also circular motion. Sometimes I will feel that the contouring is not enough, so dinadagdagan ko pa siya. So I really wanted to make my face looks very, very, very uh, yung sharp, ba? parang thin. Parang manga. Then blend it again. And an upper. Going upward and rotating motion. So, sinasama ko talaga yung dito sa may pisngi ko. Kasi ang, ang, ano ng, ang taba ng cheekbone ko. Proper blending is always sucky. So I think this is okay. And after contouring, I use the Everbelena Blush On for my cheeks. This is the Everbelena Blush Me. Gusto ko tong shade na to. It's uh, crazy. In the shade crazy. Ayoko nung masyadong pink. I like the orange uh, shade of the blush on. Ever since I was in high school, I keep putting blush on on my face. And yes, I overdo it. Talagang ganyan. Mas gusto ko yan. Mas feeling ko mas fresh looking pagka nag-start ako dito going dito. So I do it like this. And here, I put also some here. Kung saan ako nag-contour, doon ako naglalagay. And syempre, hindi ko rin nakakalimutan i-contour yung nose ko. Dahil wala akong nose. Hindi ganang katangos ang aking nose. Yes, kinakapalan ko siya. Kapalan na natin para mas magmukha akong matangos ang ilong. Do it like this. So, I'm blending it like this. Medyo mahirap kasi. I don't have mirror in front of me. I'm using the camera of my cell phone. So, medyo mahirap. So, I do like this. With the proper blending, you can do it, guys. So, para magmukhang matangos yung ilong ko, I do it. And if I overdo it, I put um, concealer on the top of my, ano, here, on the top of my nose. So, ayusin ko lang to ngayon. Kasi medyo nahihirapan ako dahil, um, sabi ko nga, Nalilito ko dun sa camera ko kung saan ako titingin. Kung dito ba sa left or dito sa right. So, I will fix this and then I will come back. So, I fixed it already. Uh, for the top of my nose, I'm using this shade. This is from the Nichido Makeup Palette. 
I'm gonna use the mirror na lang. So, naglalagay din ako sa nose ko dito. The feeling ko, pag maglagay ako, medyo tumatangos yung nose pag nilalagay ng highlighter. And then, we're going to highlight my, ano, my face. For the highlighter, I'm using this BTL um, Sculpt Trio, itong shade na to. This one, this is the highlight. So, I'm putting it here. I feel it more comfortable to use my fingers when doing the makeup than doing it with a beauty blender sponge or brush. Yung letter R ko talaga may problema yan eh. Hindi kami batin ng letter R. So, highlight my face. And then here as well, I put highlighter here. And on my nose, yan. And the side, the side of the nose. And on the forehead. So, so konting konti lang sa forehead. Kasi minsan parang feeling ko nag, uh, ano to eh, nabubuo-buo siya. So, yan. Okay, so we're done with my face. Now, let's move on with the eyes naman. For my, uh... For the eyelids, for the eyeshadow, I keep using only three shades, which is this lighter one, and then this one, and the other one, which is the darker one. So, let's move on with the eyes. I start with the lighter one to cover the lower part of my eyelid. So, I do it like this. If you can let me just use the mirror. I always wanted the natural color, yung mga nude color lang, because I feel na mas nagiging maitim ako pagka kumagamit ako ng ibang color or ibang shade. Then next, with the help of my brush, I will use this, which is the, yes, the middle shade. Nalagay ko siya here. So, I start from here going there. Sobrang konti lang, pero feeling ko minsan hindi siya enough. So, napaparami. So, like that. And then, I will be using the darker one dito naman sa side. And I do it only on a tap emotion. And then after putting all the all of the three shades, I will be blending it. So blending it correctly will give it the will give the justification of the look. Sometimes pagkatapos kong magblend, feeling ko nagpukulang yung yung light test color, so kumukuha ko ulit and then ilalagay ko siya ulit dito lang on the side. And sometimes I would want to add this shade, yung parang color white. And dito sa in between the the darker and the lightest color. So I do it like this. Ayan. Para feeling ko mas parang mas na blend yung look niya. So that's it for my eyes. After that, I will be adding highlight on the upper part of my eyelid. So using my my pinky finger, I will be adding the highlight. I am going to put eyeliner because I don't I don't like and dahil ayoko nga hindi ko siya na practice kawin. So, ganyan lang yan. Then, let's move on now to the eyelashes. For the eyelashes, I'm using this Nichido Eyelash Curler. And the 
Maybelline Hyper Curl Mascara, which is waterproof. Dapat, girls, uh, waterproof yung mascara natin or yung makeup na nilalagay natin sa face natin para hindi siya babagsak or pag na, nabasa ay hindi, ano, hindi siya kakalat sa mata. Especially the mascara that we are using should be um, uh, waterproof. So, hindi ko napansin guys na nag-full pala yung, yung uh, memory ng phone ko. So, hindi na film yung paggawa ko ng eyelashes. For the eyelashes, so I'm using this Nietzsche do and I'm doing it in 3 step. Yun nga yung sa, sa, may, sa may eyelid and then in the middle and then dito sa may tip of the eyelashes. And then, using this Maybelline um, Hyper Curl, I put a uh, mascara on the upper part of my the upper lashes and the lower lashes kung ano lang yung matira ko na product dun sa sa paggamit ko nung nung uh, paglalagay ko dito sa upper part of the eyelashes yun lang din yung nilalagay ko sa lower lash ko para hindi uh, kumalat kasi pag kumuha ka pa at marami yung nailagay mo may tendency na kumalat siya sa lower part. So, this is the look of my eyes. Pusin ko lang on the other side and then babalikan ko kayo. So, for the loose powder, I'm using this Nietzsche do in the shade of Creamy Glow. I super love this shade. Um, it's very natural looking and um, uh, glowing at the same time yung skin when you put this. So, kinukuha ko yung nandun sa takip kasi nangihinayan na naman ako. I do it like this here, the lower part of my eyes, and then the going up. Postito sa my nose, going up sa my forehead. When I put this loose powder, it's the feeling that. The feeling that I get is that parang na, na freshen up na yung face ko. Also put some of the product on my neck. When I'm doing my makeup or whenever I want to put product on my face, I always make sure that I include my neck. Kasi ladies, ang pangit tignan kung puting puti yung mukha mo, tas yung sa neck area mo ay hindi ka-shade ng face natin. Be sure that I'm always including my neck on whatever I am doing with my face. So, yon. Then, after this, we will be putting the lipstick. So, guys, kanina, naglagay ako ng um, petroleum jelly. So, niremove ko na siya using tissue. For the lips, I am using this um, Maybelline Super Stay Matte in Crayon. Labello uh, Pearly Shine. Naglalagay ako ng Labello on the entire part of my lips kasi sobrang bilis mag-dry ng lips ko. So, for the lipstick, what I am doing is um, pinifill in ko yung yung lip line ko using this Maybelline uh, Super Stay Ink. And then after putting the Maybelline, naglalagay ako nitong labelo in the middle part of my lips. So, mas dominant yung space na nilalagyan ko ng labelo kesa dun sa Maybelline. And sometimes, yeah, I overdo my lipstick. So, guys, this is my entry for my everyday makeup look. I hope that you like it.